Yo, and we're back for episode three of Road 96. Approaching election day, still trying to make it to the border without dying. Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. Let me start tonight. Would have want to give her benefit of the doubt. A question. Why she is part Flores of the propaganda machine? The brigades, or vice versa? There's no evidence to suggest that yet, but I'll keep looking. Yesterday, I had the honor to interview our Minister of Oil during the opening ceremony for a new pump. I'll show you that interview tomorrow. So tune in as our Minister reveals the secrets to our flourishing economy. Now let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. Surprisingly, it does appear Flores has some supporters, probably members of the brigades. As you know, the Sonia show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. Remember, if you have any information, please call the Sonia hotline. And that has been the Sonia Show. Okay. 16. Male. Maybe we'll cross paths with the previous episode too. Character. Oh God. These border patrol groups. Difficult, isn't it? The, the line between terrorist and freedom fighter. Yeah, I'll vandalize that. This choice has an impact. Mess some things up. Not before I give my back a scratch. Ooh. Uh, lovely. I'm sure I was a bear in a previous life. Because I'd love to just rub my back against a tree. Just wrecking the place, little rascal. I don't know if I should be doing this. Can't help myself. Oh, this is this is a propaganda sort of settlement. Oh, well, fuck you guys. most common chair in the entire world, that plastic chair. They'll be everywhere. Just to be doing then. Can I not smash this in? Oh, 
keep going. Sexual messaging from the music. Where's this? Is that cassette? I'll have that. I don't know how much developers and studios get from Game Pass when they've got a game on there. You've been breaking things, haven't you? That's not very nice. I'm scaring you, aren't I? Sorry. Follow me. I want to show you something. Impressive, isn't it? The brigades used to live here. In fact, this is where they planned the attack in 86. The brigade set off an explosion at the wall, killing hundreds. Mm -hmm. Good look up here before me. Twenty dollars. This is when the plants in the opening ceremony will strike. I think these are not infused good. What are you saying? Don't insult me. But someone I loved was. Iraq found it after the attack. It was still here smoking. were arrested. How many were never heard from again? It's not doing his throat any good. Go on. Take a look around. That's what they called the radio tree. They used it to make their radio broadcasts. You're looking at what allowed them to recruit their members. So is it arrows pointing the wrong way though, aren't they? That's what I wanted to show you. I... I think we should break it. I did. We should break it. I said break it. Or I'll find something else to break. I'm coming for you. What the hell is wrong with that guy? Of a good radio tower. I like to smoke after therapy. What size of the filter on that? What goes around comes around. I know that. my daughter the brigades took her away from me she was just 16 when she joined them her biology teacher Bob Winters recruited her she always liked Bob mm. 
I'm saving him for last. Never mind. Today's a day for healing. Oh, he's, he's going on mm. a revenge spree, is he? Is he? She was. When the day came for the attack in 86, they sent her and some other members to the wall. The detonation didn't go as planned, I guess, and she was buried beneath the rocks. Mm. She okay. wanted to be a paleontologist, someone who studies dinosaurs. She knew everything about them there was to know. Their names, what they ate, everything. Mm. What they ate. It's a tribute to my beautiful daughter, Lola. Right. This was a mistake. It didn't help. None of it. Destroying the tree. Talking. Talking. It only made things worse. You should run. Run. He's a nut job, isn't he? He's an actual nut job. <laughs> Didn't expect that to work, but. Run. Go back now and see what's going on. Right, well, we've got, we've got a hitchhike, a bus. Can I get in that car? Not open. Seven dollars for a bus. Always end up running into nut jobs hitchhiking man. Different route. Order is a dangerous place. Better be prepared before going there. It's a bank robber. Hey, kid! On your travels, have you met a woman named Sonia? You had. She's only the prettiest flower in all of Petria. Sharp has attack too. But now, some troubling news. Sonia is in danger. Someone wants to end sweet Sonia's life. Our plan is to stop this would-be killer. Before they kill Sonia. Yeah. Before mm. our hunches, the psycho is a taxi driver. Okay, taxi driver. Taxi drivers aren't no, usually bothered. But like we say, this taxi driver is a psycho. Taxi driver? That would make sense. What doesn't stand is why the kids in the sidecar. It being in the shape it is. You've gone and scared the kid, Mitch. Did, didn't I? Oh shoot. Ask us a question they if you like. one of the most dangerous things on the road, sidecars. Statistically. Sure is. That's why Mitch and I don't venture yonder. Mm -mm. 
Don't venture yonder. Ugh. Yeah, guess that would be a bummer, wouldn't it? Nope. Probably not. Long as you lean into the turns. Hmm? Just move left and right. Give it a whirl. Not bad. That's nothing. Get on up here, little buddy. Don't be scared. Whoops. Go on then. Amazing. A taxi driver oh, stood. Could be Sonia's would be killer. Kid, get back in the sidecar and help us catch that cab. Bloody hell. Money. Stan, we he's getting away. So I thought it was going to last for it. Here we go. This had to be good. So, Same kid, case. did you get a look at the driver? That's my recollection, too. Wait until Mitch gets his hands on this creep. What the? Why is he coming back? Oh, nice person. People like that don't deserve engine trouble. He's leaving! That wasn't the would-be killer, Stan. Way too nice. You let Sonia's would-be killer go, Mitch! I did not. Besides, I didn't see you get off the bike. You were scared! I was not scared! Mitch and... Maybe, but hey, let's look on the bright side. We're getting closer. We are. We almost got that psycho this time. Stand and match! What do you want to do now, little fella? Of course not.
That's a good old, good old bit of ground cover there. Riding along with it. God. Actually, I mean, they are daft, aren't they? But non-political, so perhaps a bit more trustworthy than some of the other characters I've met, without having an agenda. Get your tapes and snacks here! Tapes and snacks! I'll take a tape. Ten dollars for you, then. I am. Um, well, that's why I'm selling this stuff. Well, it's expensive to be a runaway teen. Mm, I might come back for the food. For what? Chocolate? Chocolate? Mm -hmm. What can I do for you, Kit? Uh, Ten dollars in there. What? Get out of here. Where do I recognize him from? Oh, the camp there. Get out of here. I don't get into a car with just anybody. Is there any change? Greg, I know we're all brigades here, but this teen is bothering me. There's always stealing, kid. Me too. But only one of us Alex. can win, dog. The other must be sacrificed to the gods of Paul. Do battle, we shall. Why is he doing Yoda speak? First to three wins. Isn't it the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? is a little arrogant. Same as last time. But he does have an ex-mom, so we'll forgive him. Okay, okay. Homie sees how it is. I think this is a guy, a boy, Alex. Oh, I thought that was the one. That's gonna be the one. No one's ever beaten me. I'm gonna need a minute to process this. Defeat's hard to swallow. Luckily, burgers aren't. I make games, by the way. I've even sold some to this diner. But they screw me out of my rightful cut. Yeah, they'll get theirs. Don't worry. De 
depends on your fiscals. But word is, there's a psycho cabbie dude out there. Maybe he'd get you across, but dead and stuffed in the trunk. Sorry, homie went a little dark there. I just had an idea. Time to take what's mine. Come on. God, he's got an antenna and he's sticking out of his books. Like, oh god, I am Alex. I've done that. Oh no. I want a hike. Well, there's no mobile phone reception. I took a radio in. To improve signal strength. I, uh. Look an antenna on it. Right, well, that was a bit pointless going in there, wasn't it? I thought I could get another drink out of the tap. Where have you gone, Alex? Didn't Alex have a camper van or something? Are you there? Hey, let's just trust this right away, just before we do anything. The job's simple. There's a room in the back where they keep their cash. I should be able to hack in. Exactly, Home Slice. Come on! Yo! This digicode is from the age of the dinosaurs. Nah, homie. But I got some tech to use on it. One day, Scientist gonna study my brain. Boom! What I tell you? Oh man, door closed behind us. Gonna re-trigger the digi lock. Twenty dollars there. I'll pick the lock or break the lock. Homie, by now you should know who you're dealing with. Now, let's look for the dough. Found a lot it. of stuff in here. And it smells. Ugh, adults. Check the drawers. And the safe, too. <laughs> Duh. Yeah, I can't do much to the safe. Code is. Can't guess it. Zero percent chance of guessing it correctly. It says. Which isn't true. It's a four-digit company. Anyway. Well, dude. I've got the money. Oh, what's this? What to be this? Something odd's happened because I've got the money, but Alex isn't aware I've taken the money, so I can't trigger a dialogue with Alex. And all I can do is just 1986. Okay, Alex, let's get the fuck out of here. Jesus, dude. This is weird because there's not much I can do. Okay, that's a bit bugged out then, isn't it? 
Let's return to the main menu. See what it does. Return to the main menu. Let's go back into this now. Computing the next step. I could do a bit of lunch actually. All right. Spot of luncheon, nice salad. Baked potato with cheese, yes. Rather. Wait. What? Oh no, not this. Oh man. Oh man. Make me replay this. Well, at least I can do some different dialogue choices. Beep, boop, beep. Beep, boop, beep. Beep, boop, beep, boop, boop, boop. Yo, Get your tapes and snacks here. Sir. Tapes and snacks. Take a tape. Uh, got any travel advice? Music goes well with the road. It's like the perfect compliment to being on a road it trip. Is true. I was looking for something a little bit more pragmatic. Never mind. What can I do for you, kid? Nothing. I don't get into a car with just anybody. Yeah. Okay. What about you? I do not. You, you should steal the creep manager's car keys. He keeps them in a room behind the diner. Okay, creep manager's car keys. Yo, Pong, I love Pong. Me too, but only one of us can win, dog. The other must be sacrificed to the gods of Pong. Why does this kid Alex use terms like Dog and homie. Three Cultural appropriation, I suspect. Isn't it the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? Oh, yes. Oh, no. Yes, 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 yes. Score against me? Oh, hell no. Nah. Dude, I am going to. Absolutely thrush you at Pong. Oh, you were so lucky there. Okay, okay. Homie Faster. sees how it is. Homie sees how and talks in the third person. Getting a good angle on this thing. There we go. No one's ever beaten me. I'm going to need a minute to process this. <sighs> Defeat's hard to swallow. Luckily, Burgers aren't. I make games, by the way. I've even sold some to this diner, but they screw me out of my rightful cut. Yeah, they'll get theirs. Don't worry. Okay. Depends on your fiscals. But word is, there's a psycho cabbie dude out there. Oh man, that'd be kind of nice. I just had an idea. Time to take what's mine. Come on. Oh, I like this, Alex. It's pretty cool. Greg, I know we're all brigades here, but this teen is bothering me.
Come on, let's the go. job's simple. There's a room in the back where they keep their cash. I should be able to hack in. Oh, I, I have absolutely confident. Exactly, home slice. Come on. Absolutely confident. Almost like I've seen you do it before. God damn it. Yo, this digicode is from the age of the dinosaurs. I made some sexy digicode tech. One day, scientists gonna study my brain. Boom! What I tell you? Oh man, door closed behind us. Gonna re-trigger the digi lock. That's not good. Fear lowers one's intelligence. Now, let's look for the dough. Fear is the mind killer. A lot of stuff in here. And it smells. Ugh, oh, I adults. don't know where it could be. Where could it be? Check the drawers. Check the and drawers, that's an idea. Duh. Let's check the drawers. Oh, there we go. Found it in there. What about this drawer? Oh, I thought the, the creep manager's keys were in here. No? Right. I'm now stuck. Again, god damn it! So the previous time I got stuck it was a waste of time. Hold up. Okay. There's an article here on the attack. Bodies of certain brigades believed to be at the wall were never found. No way. My bio parents might still be alive. Here, I, I gotta finish reading this article. I've acquired the hacking ability. Oh, can't hack that though. Let's fix it. Let's hack that. One. Should we take the lot? I think we should take the lot. Someone coming! Hide! Where? Where exactly am I going to hide? Alex, where? Say a word. Some games pick up on the microphone sounds. I think Grand Theft Auto 5 was like that. If you point a gun at the shopkeeper and start shouting down the mic. Al, have you been in the back room lately? Looks different, like someone's been back here. Yeah, I'll check. Just give me a second. Bad news. It's empty. Okay, I'll sit tight. Uh huh. Okay, bye. Oh, no, 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 no! Hey! Who's in there? Run! Hold on, just whatever you took, give it back. It's your lucky day, kid. Get out of here before I change my mind. Really? Just let me get with a hundred dollars. I thought I had these car keys. What's the vehicle at the back here then? There's no vehicle. Okay. You know what? I'll take that food off you, dude. Good luck on your journey.
Is Alex? Alex has popped off. He's been going down in the basket. Car ride, is it? I don't know. No. Not a battery. Where is it then? Oh, it's a payphone taxi. So, let's hitch. Ride, ride, ride. I'm hitching a ride. It's going to be that dodgy taxi driver. Psycho taxi. Ride, ride, ride. I'm hitching a ride. Don't blame it on the sunshine. Blame it on the rain. Look how many American trucks are just so highly decorated, customized, personalized. Uh, uh, I haven't been sleeping well lately. Papa Bear. Found my tapes, huh? Yeah, Each one comes with a ton of memories. Took one, did you? Well, just take care of it, all right? Last good night's sleep I had was the day I played soccer with that kid. But I don't know why I'm telling you. Whoa. Hey, now. No one touches my radio but me. Rubber ducky. Uh, no can do, young wolf. Gotta get this precious cargo somewhere fast. But let's have a little chat. You Shouldn't start. Be. Hmm. Well, it's dangerous. That's for sure. I see. Oh well. Get to the border. Then pick a lock and get in one of the trucks at the gate. Then don't make a sound. That part's very important. Okay. How about your truck? Dude. Hey, hey now. God damn, this old lion's tired. <laughs> I like you, young blood. My acupuncturist says I got large chi reserves <laughs> below my spine. Well, I'll just tap into those and. I like Papa Bear. Good to go. <laughs> but you should rest. Need your energy on the road. Go on, young lion. Ain't got all my fingers, but you're in good hands. Well, can I go sleep in your cab? Hitching a ride. Gosh, just mimicking the game. Oh, dude. sleep at the wheel once before in my life. It is so fucking scary. I should, yeah. But uh, you gotta get this cargo somewhere fast. I'll stop saying that. Nothing's worth your life. Uh, 
Adult diapers. Yeah, don't make fun of me. Oh, just up the road. Yeah, only one solution. You gotta make me an omen vitality. Say what? Get in the back. I'll explain. Sorry about the mess. I'm not the cleanest ombre. There's a big softy. I'm not stealing his food. There's mama bear, I presume. Omen Vitality. Shake it. Okay. Give me some instructions. That's Connie, young blood. Beautiful, isn't she? Mind putting that back? That's a real valuable object. Pains me to say this, but Connie's no longer with us. She passed away ten years ago, when the peak collapsed. Mm, that's how I lost these fingers, trying to get to her under the fallen rocks. But the truth is, I'd have given my whole arm, my whole life, to save her. She was the wind in my sails. And I'll miss her for the rest of my days. How have they structured this now I really game? need that drink. There's such coherent narrative, that's what I want to Gonna look for some hard rock. Time to dispel the darkness. Okay. Ready to make your drink? I'm falling asleep myself. You found the recipe. Most Insane. ingredients should be in the fridge. Cucumber coffee beans. Oh my god. Put them all together, shake hard and fast for my big J to keep you awake on those nights. Your darling Connie. Oh my god. Ginseng, cucumber and coffee beans. Cucumber should be up top. Not my cucumber though. Okay. Check for the beans at the bottom. Um. Go ahead and move those items to grab what you need. Any beans then? Not that. Is that not beans? What's the beans then? Go What's ahead and move those items. I was looking for bait beans, I don't know why. To grab with the ginseng should be somewhere back there. Oh, we don't call it ginseng, but that's a nicer. What the hell do we call it? Just ginger. Oh, I like the, the word ginseng. Americans call something so different zucchini, so I like that. I prefer zucchini. Uh, as a term, and they say oregano. I don't know. What's the other thing? Cilantro. I think they say cilantro instead of whatever we Just call it. Shake it now. That's what I heard. Hell yeah! Cilantro. Good too. Woo! Oh, coriander. I think cilantro is what they call it. Hey, coriander. If I drink almost ready. Vitality! Go on, sip your line and put hair on your mane. <laughs> Good stuff. I knew you'd like it. Keep the recipe, it'll come in handy. This ability adds two additional bars to your total energy capacity. Now, time to put the pedal to the metal. Welcome to ride with me further if you want. Your choice. Yeah, man. Okay then, here we go! Woo! Oh, 
Oh, so that's some distance covered, actually. Wow. Oh, I've intersected the path of episode one. I need a vitality omen myself. I just go for regular coffee. Chair. There was a chair. There was a chair there. Last time I was here, I didn't see a chair. That's weird, that zoom. It seems to make me walk faster, I don't know how. What happens if I zoom in while I'm walking backwards? The rate of zoom is the same as the rate of it's the same as the rate of walking. So it has a weird effect like this, and then it zooms back out. Zoom in, zoom out, zoom in, zoom out, zoom in. Zoom out, zoom in, zoom out. See what's in this cool box down here. I wonder if one day somebody will be sat in that chair. Somebody else sit in the chair. A bloody barrel. Nothing to see, nothing to do here. I like your music, so me no change your music. It's quite cool that music actually. Hopefully YouTube will copyright flag it and then I'll find out the name. Unless I shazam it. I shazam it. Shazam! Let's keep moving forward by the Toxic Avenger. That's quite cool. I'm going to give that a, a stick into my playlist. Keep moving forward by the Toxic Avenger. I like it. I think I like it because I like this game. And that's a strange thing about music. For me, anyway. There's a lot of associative and nostalgic bias. Like I like some tunes that I've heard on holiday. Actually, isn't there isn't there a sleep area down here? Yeah. Isn't there a rock here? The person who left some money here, I heard rumours about this rock, but no, it actually existed. Anyway, I don't know who you are, or if you're a cross like me, but thanks, I really mean it. Because of you, I now have a chance to leave this hell out. Rest here though. Last time I was able to rest. 
I'll need quite a bit of energy if I'm going to do that mountain trek. Just one bar. Let's try and go for the mountain pass. Not. I haven't got a lockpick skill. I presume I need to have because every time there's a lot of options in red. So zoom in, zoom out, zoom in, zoom out, zoom in, zoom out, zoom in, zoom out. I really want to walk all the way up. No, 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 don't walk. You'll get knackered. You'll tire yourself out. I don't want to be spending ten dollars on a bloody chocolate bar. Let's do the game price then. Oh, my energy's still good. Can I get away with it with these extra two bars this time? Mm. Oh, yo, what's up? Who's that? Snacks and drinks? Hi. Can I help you at all? I wanted to cross, but I don't have enough money for a coyote. Maybe I'll just go home soon anyway. Maybe you're right. Thanks for the pep talk. Good. I don't have twenty-five dollars. I know what's on that TV. We've had that conversation. Don't know who's standing it'd be if it wasn't. Of course, I've sent him out on the road. Sent a few here too. But the real protest here will go down on election day. Kid, you've got to show more discretion. There are guards here who'd like nothing more than to arrest us. Even take a moment to see the choices you made. I can't even afford food now. One buck, one dollar, one single buck. So I could look pink. I could also force myself into a truck. I could take this mountain pass again. And this time I've got more energy, so I like the idea of it. Wait. How do I do it? Dude. I thought there was a mountain pass. I'm sure I took a mountain pass. Does he not give me any more information? Some more info, dude. Can we trust you? Okay. Some kids try to hide in the trucks and get through that way. Of course, there's no guarantee you'll get past security. They got all kinds of security measures. I hope you find your freedom, kid. We'll be rooting for you. So the mountain pass isn't available to me this time. Then. So, I presume that's what it means. Because... One option. What's that option down there? 
Oh, let's just get in the truck. He obviously wants us to. Loading maps. Freedom. Nothing is more important, but there are many others in Petra still looking for it. And their journeys have only just begun. They've only just begun. Right, so we're into July now. July the 1st. 1996. I wonder why 1996. And next up then, we've played episode 1, 2 and 3. So we'll be doing episode 4 next time i don't know how this game is completed or if it can be completed i'm going to go and get some luncheon and it is now 1 50 so i think i'll be back on at 3 p.m after i've had a bit of lunch a bit of a pipe 
and pegged out some washing. <laughs> okay, that is my sad ball of a life. See you in a bit. Three o'clock.